Oh, Sips is messaging me. Oh yeah, what's he saying? He's saying Molten Core in Minecraft, uh, in World of Warcraft. We should do it. Oh, we should. But That'd be he, fun. Um, he's on American service, so he can't do it with us. Oh, uh, that sucks. Why is, why is he doing on American service? Oh, I don't know. He's, a, he's an idiot. Mm. <laughs> did he just not realise? <laughs> well, because he, he did. Do you remember? He um, he decided he got fed up with all the, the, the queuing. Oh, I don't and blame so he him. He went to America. He basically bought a whole brand new. Copy of he the... bought the whole game and all the expansions. Again, yeah. Wow. What a maniac. That must have been pretty expensive. It was, I think. So, there's some grapes. Okay. Um, so these, this is wine, right? That's wine. Okay, I'll, 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 I'll make a, I'll make a sign. We're gonna need one cask of it upstairs. You know, because oh, yeah, we're gonna yeah. need to roll one up, the, up the slope into the bar. You know. I've, uh, I've got some. Um, some pipes actually so we can pipe from the wine from the full ones down here up to the to the one that we pipe from can we put taps is there taps um, is that a thing yeah i i, I don't know if a taps are a thing we Maybe. probably just right click with bottles though can't we i think right? we might just have to pretend yeah it is minecraft after all it's not actually a real pub oh no what's wrong, what's wrong? just put i just right clicked on the floor with the box oh okay it's okay i got it back I got it back right so that over this side is Ale, so that's the ale over this. Shall I fill up some, some wine bottles and put them on the shelf? Then? Yeah, definitely. All right, let's get that. Now, you there. might have to change the shelves because these are potion shelves. I'm not convinced they're going to hold the, um, the, 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 the bottles. Oh, yes, we shall see. We, we shall. shall. We shall see. Oops. Okay. Actually, that's a good point. I think they might not. Oh, whoa, what? The... There's not much. These barrels are now empty. How many did you get? About 25. 25 bottles of wine. From three barrels. That's pretty standard, I think. Oh, is it? Okay. And no, what's I think this stuff? Actually, I wonder how much wine you can get out of a Grape barrel. wine and ale. Is there, is there a different kind of wine? Uh, well, you can make... Shin, wine is kind of a definition of, of something. Wine just means, you know, fermented grapes. You know, oh, okay. If you ferment anything, it makes different things. So if you ferment, like, potatoes, that's vodka. If you ferment potatoes wheat, vodka. it's like whiskey if you ferment yeah i think so um vodka comes from potatoes but it's just and sake is rice obviously oh you're right i can't put potions i can't put grape wine in these potion shelves i think that's it works. people will probably correct me but uh, i think like whatever it's it, you know beer just means fermented from hops right yeah, so it, the, the definition of these different beverages, so like can, tequila is from cactus. You can see. you ferment any kind of like anything? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, whoa! So what if you like make like a like a super fruit salad? Then you ferment that. Can well, I mean, like there a... was like stories of this, there wasn't there? Because like you'd get like um, you'd get like prisoners in prison camps making moonshine. Okay? Yeah, and moonshine is kind of just generic whatever they can make it out of. So, for example, people would be given, like, in the wartime, they'd be given, like, a bag of sugar. That was all they had. Wow. And so they'd have, like, a they'd, they'd make a, you know, bag of sugar, ferment that up, and they'd end up with sort of moonshine. Or they'd get, like, strawberry jam. Mm. So they'd have straw... They'd make, um, they'd make alcohol out of strawberry jam, you see. Right, okay. And I'm they could make... make moonshine out of that. Does it taste good? Is moonshine... Have you ever had moonshine? Well, moonshine is just a definition for... It depends, you know. It's just going to be alcoholic, so it's going to be that whole strong tasting, strong smelling stuff, you know. Right. Have you ever had moonshine? Uh, well, it Come depends on. what you mean. I've had, I've had my dad once Admitted. made some like carrot wine, which carrot, I guess would that, be, I would rather define as moonshine. That sounds kind of cool, though, to be honest. Carrot wine. Yeah, well. It wasn't very nice. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. traumatic stories of youth. <laughs> Once my father made me eat carrot wine. Drink carrot wine. Yeah. That's two, two, four. What's this one? That's 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 pretty. That's pretty intense, actually. I I I, I can that's go for eight. some carrot wine right now, though. Okay, I've, I've forgotten which my boxes were. Here's some. Um, this is the this is the sake. All right. So let me put down the ale. Actually, is that the ale? Is that the ale here? Oh, it's empty. I'm making some bibliocraft shelves. Oh, These should work. They're, 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 they're empty. What? What, what? what? There's bottles everywhere on the floor here, though. Oh, did I? Have I just made a mess? Yeah, you just left loads of beer hanging around, lying around on the floor. Oh, I'm sorry. You're not going to be a terrible barman. I'm not. <laughs> you're fired. Well, no, I was right clicking like a, like like crazy, and I just wasn't. I, I guess it was just like flying behind me. Do, do, do. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming with some That's shelving, real. some real deal shelving. Real deal. It's the real deal. It's, it's no fake shelving here. I'm no cowboy B 
bebop builder. Oh, flipping heck. What are we going to do about what are we going to do about all this moonstone? It's just everywhere. I'm uh, just going to start I don't know. It. I'm going to get get rid of some of it. Okay, that's the aim. It's actually really valuable. Like it's a magical like kind of thing. What can you do with it though? You can do magical stuff with it. What kind of stuff? Like spells. Magical spells. Yeah, and enchantments and Is stuff. It important. It's pretty. It's a pretty big deal. It's like um, it's like if it's like if, if diamond is um, sunstone, then moonstone is like gold. Oh right. Okay. So it's, wow. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty useful to have some of it. I've got a cardboard box here, a spare one. If you want, I'll just chuck that outside the front door. I think we because we don't have any use for it. We just built up this big stockpile. I think it would be this thing that if we were doing magic might be actually really valuable to us. But yeah. Oh, I've got to be very careful breaking these shelves. Have you? Why? One false move and I unleash the demon. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to unleash the demon. Okay, don't unleash. I did that once before. It was messy. Oh dear. Yeah. Oh what? Well, yeah, there's, there's just there's just what is this? There's bottles of beer all over. Yeah. Well, I don't. I think you're just dropping them. Oh well, I can't hold all these bottles to be honest. I haven't got enough hands. Didn't they do a calculation about? You know, you can hold gold blocks in Minecraft. Uh huh. They did. Uh, they they worked out exactly like how much that would actually weigh in the real world. These gold blocks, and I think they decided it was like more than a planet. Wow. To hold your whole in inventory with sixty-four stacks or stacks of sixty-four gold blocks. One meter by one meter cubes of gold. Yeah. It would weigh more than a planet. I think so. Wow. It's pretty intense. That's eh? a pretty cool thing. Gold is he very heavy, actually. It's the heaviest of the heavies, isn't it? It's not quite as heavy as lead. Oh, whoops. Um, but it's pretty heavy. Is that why you can turn lead into gold with alchemy? Uh, it might be. Do you know what? It might be as heavy as, as lead. You can't turn lead into gold either. Can you not? Alchemy. No, not really. I thought you could. They wanted. They believed you could. Why did they believe you could? Well, because it was kind of the ultimate thing, wasn't it? If you could make, you know, gold out of useless lead. If you could, people sort of, people back then, they didn't understand Anything. elements, elements, and why that's not possible. Right. Why is it not possible? Um, why is it not possible to turn lead into gold? Yes. Is, that, is this a trick question? No. I don't know. Why isn't it possible? Why? Because why? What do you mean? What do you mean? Wait, I suppose you could. <laughs> you just asked me the question. I thought you knew the answer. God damn it. I'm putting these in the wrong place. No, because like I thought they, they didn't they think that like like if you put it in like a, a large hadron collider or something, like a particle accelerator and you just chip off a few atoms, it becomes gold, right? So how it works? Yeah. That's not completely off the mark, I suppose. Really? Well, you can you oh, can make yes. gold from heavy elements by Chipping bits off it, but does that work? It's not very efficient. It's no, not at all efficient. Could you, would you make like one atom of gold? Well, I mean that gold. It's it's more efficient to make gold by oh, by great. by fission and fusion. Fission. Um, sorry, by by fusion and fission. So you like can, you can't fish for gold. What are you talking about? Pfft. Well, like it's made in the sun, isn't it? Gold. What? And stuff and stars. You mean yeah. you have, you grow it? I said. You get it from no. Oh, I'm going down a strange path again. <laughs> no, no, I'm going slightly insane. Uh, okay, um, I've got the. That's the sake. That's the, what's left of the wine, and I'm going to put the cider down here. Okay, in goes the wine. This is looking great. This the bottles are really shiny, so it's it, it kind of it hides the demon as well, which might put some customers off. I think. Right. If they can actually see a live demon behind the bar, they might actually want to leave the establishment. God, I made a mistake, but that's fine. I'm just going to leave that there. Oh, this is looking okay, pretty good. good. So we need a guest list for who we're going to invite to this party. Right. Um, we can invite Hat Films. Okay. Uh, I also want to invite um, Nicolas Cage. Right. Send out an invite to him. Uh, who else do you want to be at the party? Uh... Who, who needs to be there? Um, who needs Stroot? to be there? Stroot, Stroot, yes. Oh, wait, hang on a sec. I know we said it's big, but I'm not sure he could fit. What do you mean? He could just go outside. He'll, he'll just hang he around could, outside. Oh, there is a beer garden. So yeah, yeah he, he could. If he just sits around outside. We've got a few barrels that he can just, you know, he can have a couple of barrels. He could. Get, oh, wow, oh, we're going to have to make loads more wine then to, to, to Jesus, sate. Jesus, this is quite impressive, this. His appetite. What's What are you doing? 
It's so, I like the purple of them because it sort of blends in with the purple of the decor of the obsidian here. Oh, the, yeah, it does, doesn't it? It looks pretty cool. It sort of, looks, it sort of fits. That's, that is wine and, I think, ale. Why do you think Minecraft decided that purple would be the colour for enchanted armour and stuff and enchanted things? Honestly, I think it's because in World of Warcraft, epic gear is purple. Oh, maybe. I think so much of it, so much of modern games, especially RPGs and itemization, stems from the fact that in World of Warcraft, normal gear is white, green is uncommon. I mean, that was not that cre original, cruelly created by them, though. Was it not? No, was it that, I mean, EverQuest? games did that a long... Yeah, EverQuest and games like before that. Really? I used, didn't know that. these things. And even board games have used that sort of colour coordinate system. Wow. Yeah. It's been much older. Everything has its roots to, like, other stuff. But it, it people remember the thing that popularised it, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. I didn't know that, though. So who do you think invented the fact that loot should be a different colour? Probably, like... Um, that guy who done um, who done Dungeons and Dragons. What's his name? Tron. Tron. No, um, G Gygax. Gygax. Gary Gygax. Gary Gygax. He done yeah. it. It was probably him. He done everything. He did everything. Wow. He done. He done he, it all. He, he gone done everything. He was amazing. He was. He was a legend. I remember when he died. It was a very sad day. Relatively but, recently, I think. Wasn't yeah, it, it was. It was a few years ago, actually. Yeah. Oh, Gary. I saw some reference to in WoW to him actually the other day. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, there you go. Is... I think the bar's looking better. It will require a little bit of decoration, but interiors are not your strong suit, or are they necessarily? Shame. What are you talking about? This place looks well, great. We've got no tables in here. What are we going to do? We've got couches. Okay, let's get some couches. Um, um, and we'll get. Some... Let's put a couch here. Wow. <laughs> I don't know. Where are we going to put a couch? This is. It kind of works for like a countryside pub, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Put another couch here so it's like. Well, like over here? Like, wait, like here. No, no. Oh. No, like, oh, yeah, so it's like... What if I wrap it around like that? Mm, that's actually not terrible. It's more like a diner now, oh. though. Oh, what something. have I done there? You've uh, put the couch down. Oh, no. You're now sitting on it backwards. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you're, not, you're sitting on the couch backwards now. Oh. How do I break it? There you we go. Smash it. Smash it. Smashing. There you go. Um, if I put some seats just around the edge like this, what do you reckon? Does that look good? Maybe. And can, we can put tables in the middle. I can kind of like edge along them. Look, shuffle along. <laughs> hey, no, stop wiping your bum on the sofa. It, it's like if you were sitting there on a having a meal. Yeah. And you you needed to get a little loot. You'd have to shuffle out the whole row. Like, sorry, excuse oh, me. Oh, I've had to sorry, do that. Excuse me. Everyone has to get up. I've had to do that before. It's, oh, not, it's really awkward. It's not good. Yeah. Especially if you you got like you know the farts and you're farting on everybody's seat as you go. What do you mean you've got the farts? Well, you know, sometimes sometimes alcohol makes you want to, you know... It's not happened to me a lot. I mean, getting the farts just as I needed to... Well, maybe... You've been lucky. But is, is, it, is it something that happens I, I have to look forward to? No, it to. doesn't happen to me. It's ever. <laughs> <laughs> it's ever happened. Oh, well, there you go. I think that'll do for today. Do you reckon... Do you reckon I, I think we need a couple more couches. I'm just going to put a couple in Thank there. Thank you for watching Shin's Farm. Everyone, thank you for watching. And we'll see we'll you put next together time. the guest list, and uh, and we'll get we'll see if we can get some people in, and we'll finally have a shindig to end all shindigs. We're just gonna get smashed. Yeah, we've we'll got we we'll got food on. We've got so much It'll wine be chili and based. ale. Where's the sake, by the way? Did you bring the sake in? Uh, yeah, I put it somewhere. Oh yeah, it's down here. Yeah. All right, I have to get these signed up so that I can, people can see what it is. Okay. We'll get the kettles in here as well so that we can like actually do some brewing. Oh, so if idea. we run out, then we don't have like a shortage. Okay, I like it. And then All we can right. show it off, see yeah. what the hats guys think. Okay. Okay, Dick. See you later. Bye! Bye!